Hi, my name is Lavish Kumar. In this video, we will go over the new Knobcommerce 4.0 version and some of the latest features and improvements. So Knobcommerce 4.0 is now available for download from the Knobcommerce website. The latest release offers a lot of new improvements and features. From a very high level, there's a lot of new features that the latest Knobcommerce 4.0 has to offer. But one of the main enhancements in Knobcommerce 4.0 is moving the whole project to ASP.NET Core in order to follow the latest technology trend in .NET and offering the best user experience. So the latest 4.0 version offers a lot of bug fixes, source code refracting, performance optimization, and a ton of new features and improvements. So let's start with some of the highlights of the these new features and enhancement. So one of the great feature that was added in Knobcommerce 4.0 was the improved and enhanced plugin and theme pages in dashboard section. So if I go to the dashboard and log in as admin, if I go to configuration and plugins right here. So one of the improvement that was done in 4.0 is initial until Knobcommerce 3.9 version an admin, if we have to add any plugin or team to the Knobcommerce side, we have to upload that team via FTP on the server. But for now, in the 4.0 version, a store admin can simply upload the plugin or theme right from the admin section in the dashboard. You don't have to use FTP anymore, though you do have the option to manually install any plugin or theme from FTP but this makes things so much easier for any store admin who is not a tech savvy person. So that's another great enhancement in Knobcommerce 4.0 version. So now let's look into the another new setting that was added. It's called nested settings in Knobcommerce. The nesting setting feature is a great improvement in terms of better user experience and allows store owner to manage different Knobcommerce settings conveniently. Let's look into the nested settings in Knobcommerce 4.0. So this is one example of nested settings. So I simply, if you are enabling Sitemap Enable, you'll see all the nested features that are linked with the Sitemap Enable. So it basically just to give a, a better user interface for store admin to see that what features are connected with any any settings. So for an instance, if I Let's say if I scroll down and I enable capture enable, it will go give me all the features that are linked with these. So basically nested settings are giving me a great visual interface of how other settings are connected with um, an option or feature. So this makes um, store owner's job quite easy to determine what feature is connected with what. Another enhancement in Knobcommerce 4.0 is dynamic update of order total when updating checkout attributes. So until Knobcommerce 3.9.0, when checkout attributes were displayed on the checkout page, the order total was not being updated. Now it, it can happen actually. So let, let me show you an example here. So if I go to the public store, if I add any product in the shopping cart, so let's say I pick this product, add to cart, and I go to shopping cart page. Okay, so right here on the shopping cart page, I have a checkout edge attribute called gift wrapping. So it gives me the option that if I would like to um, select the option to wrap this item. So if I select this item, just Keep an eye on this order total. When it's like yes, it gets updated automatically. And this is a great feature that has been added in Knobcommerce 4.0. It makes the overall site quite user friendly for the customer so they can see the updated price right away. So, another feature that was added in Knobcommerce 4.0 was for managing vendors. 
big, it's a small feature, but very important feature when it comes to managing vendors on your knob commerce site. Basically, a feature was added for vendors. Uh, if I go in the dashboard, vendor settings, terms and service. This feature was added. This feature requires vendors to accept terms of service during registrations. So if I select here, I can save it here and if I go to content management topics I have a dedicated page for vendor terms of service I can edit this page and I can edit the content on this page so let me open the site on a different browser so I can give you an example so here I'm on the same public store if I click on apply for vendor account now that I have the accept terms for use option enabled for vendors when I apply for a vendor account put my email address description I get this option accept terms and services and I can see the content that we added right here so this is a great addition when you are managing different vendors on your knob commerce site so there is a long list of improvements in Knobcommerce 4.0 version and you can look into the release notes section of Knobcommerce site. If you go to Knobcommerce site, go to release notes and you can see there's a really huge list of improvements and bug fixes that was done in Knobcommerce 4.0 version. And if you have any questions or feedback, please feel free to post in the comment section below. Now it's time for us to wrap up this tutorial video. Hope this was helpful. This video is brought to you by Knob Commerce, open source shopping car. Thank you.